What's up, Juggalos and Juggalettes? Uh, um, this is a video about, well, it's really, okay, Cut Calhoun just released a video explaining why I left Strange Music. Not the freestyle, he just released one a day. Uh, explaining why he left Strange Music, and I mean, he was vague about everything, I mean, I guess for respect, uh, which I'm, I thought it was really cool to, of him to respect his label or whatever, or his ex-label. Uh, and, well, first off, he made the announcement that he is creating his own label, which I think is great as a Cut Calhoun fan myself. It's like he said, uh, number one thing I want to talk about is, uh, people that don't like Cut Calhoun do to him leaving Strange Music. Were you really a Cut Calhoun fan then, or were you a Strange Music fan? I love Strange Music. I'm absolutely in love with Strange Music. Um, but see, it goes back to like with Psychopathic and Strange Music and Suburban Noise and any record label you want to go to, it has its own demons. You know what I'm saying? It has its own problems. It has its own issues. You know what I'm saying? Every nothing's perfect. Uh, Cut Calhoun and Rounder Up about what way was just trying to explain why he left. He has on reasons. He was he didn't say anything specifically. All he was saying is that you know well the vagueness he got was that you know he just didn't he didn't feel like he got he didn't get out of it what he put into it. Like, man, I don't forgot man. I gotta fix the thing. Oh uh, yeah, he didn't get out of it what he put into it. And I could see where that would you know. Okay, and it's like I said, I mean, he was being, he was really trying to be vague and really, uh, you know, he was really trying to be respectful about it, so, I mean, there ain't no telling, I mean, Tech Nine's getting bigger and bigger and bigger, and, you know, maybe he just didn't feel like he was trying, he didn't get what he, what he deserved, you know, and I can see that, you know what I'm saying, if you, it's like you said, he's been this since the beginning, and I am one of those ones that has done the research, Cut Calhoun's been there, man, you know what I'm saying, he told us to do the research, well, I've done the research and have in the past, and Cut Calhoun's been there, you know, it's like you said, him, Chris Calico, and Tech Nine, that's who you had, Travis Aguin, you know what I'm saying, he came along before Travis did, um, it's like he was saying, he explained it, uh, but his channel is Melvin Calhoun, now he says he's gonna start his own label, which I think is great, you know what I'm saying, why not, dude, hey, I'm a rapper, let me in, dude, let me in, I understand your pain, <laughs> but, uh, but for real, uh, I think it's great. I love Cut Calhoun. He's a great rapper. He's a great, and really, I mean, every, I mean, I don't know the guy personally, but he seems like a really decent dude. You know what I'm saying? I mean, nobody, I mean, everybody's got their own thing, but I mean, he seems like a pretty decent guy. Uh, really, it really sucks. Yeah, at least strange music because I do love strange music. But I mean, thing about it is, you gotta do what you gotta do, and he felt that's what he needed to do. So you gotta do what you gotta do. It's like I said. Uh, that being said, much clown love. Whoop whoop. Peace out.